Hello, and welcome to, Today in History, I'm your host, Abdalman El Dara, and I'm excited to take you on a journey through some of the most significant historical events that occurred on this day in history, so let's jump right in. On April 4, 1841, William Henry Harrison, the ninth president of the United States, died of pneumonia just 31 days into his presidency. Harrison's death made him the shortest-serving president in American history and raised concerns about the stability of the presidency in times of crisis. On this day in 1968, civil rights leader Martin Luther King Jr. was assassinated in Memphis, Tennessee. King was in Memphis to support striking sanitation workers and was shot by James Earl Ray, a white supremacist. King's death sparked riots and protests across the country and is considered a pivotal moment in the civil rights movement. On April 4, 1949, the North Atlantic Treaty was signed in Washington, D.C., establishing the North Atlantic Treaty Organization, NATO. NATO is a military alliance between North American and European countries that was formed to counter the Soviet Union during the Cold War. On April 4, 1973, the construction of the World Trade Center in New York City was completed. The complex consisted of two towers, each standing at 110 stories tall, and was one of the most iconic landmarks in the city until its tragic destruction on September 11, 2001. On April 4, 1850, the city of Los Angeles was officially incorporated as a city in California, marking an important milestone in the history of the state. This laid the foundation for the growth and development of the city, which would go on to become one of the most populous and culturally significant cities in the United States. April 4, 1818, marked the adoption of the current version of the United States flag, which features 13 horizontal stripes alternating between red and white, and a blue field with 50 white, five-pointed stars. This version of the flag has been in use for over 200 years and has become a symbol of American patriotism. On this day in 1975, Microsoft was founded by Bill Gates and Paul Allen in Albuquerque, New Mexico. The company would go on to become one of the most successful and influential technology companies in history, revolutionizing the personal computer industry and paving the way for modern computing. On April 4, 1960, Senegal gained independence from France, becoming the first African colony to gain independence from a European colonial power. The independence movement in Senegal inspired other African nations to fight for their freedom, and Senegal continues to be a leader in African politics and culture. That's it for today's episode of Today in History. I hope you enjoyed learning about these significant events that took place on this day throughout history. Join me again tomorrow for another exciting episode. Thanks for watching.